everyone, I'm Kate Schwenke and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a fun new packing video for you guys featuring the Jujubee Bee Packed in the Queen's Court print. The Bee Packed is one of my all-time favorite Jujubee bags because it holds just the necessities for me and my boys. But today I have it packed up a little bit differently and I definitely wanted to share that with you guys before I went on my trip this weekend. So I have this bag packed up for me and my three boys and this is packed for a trip to Kings Island, which is a theme park if you're in California. Kings Island is just like Knott's Berry Farm, but in Ohio. <laughs> so this is actually the very first time I have packed up the Be Packed for this type of trip. You guys know I normally take the Be Right Back because I feel like it just holds a lot more. I can put my baby carrier in it and all that. But for this trip, we're actually going to be using the stroller as well. So I'm going to have a stroller caddy to hold extra drinks and tickets and things like that. And then also the undercarriage of the stroller is going to have my baby carrier, which leaves me being able to pack this as minimalistically as I possibly could. And I am super happy with how it turned out. So let's go ahead and dive in. If you guys are new to the Be Packed, this is a great little bag for carrying around town. And as you can see in this video, great for even a theme park. You have a very nice grab handle up top here, which makes it easy to pick this bag up in and out of the car or off the ground. You have two elastic bottle pockets, one on each side. You have a zipper compartment in the front here. You have these very nice backpack straps on the back that are very adjustable. And then on the very top of the bag, on the back here, there's kind of a hidden pocket. This is your tech pocket. So that's basically the outside of the bag. So we're gonna go ahead and just jump on into the packing portion because this is more of a packing video than a review. So let's get into these pockets. So this is how I have the inside packed up. As you can see, this particular print has this gorgeous sky blue lining. I love it. This pocket doesn't have too much organization. You do have two mesh elastic pockets on the inside here. These are great pockets to hold things that you don't want to get jostled around in the pocket. So I have my be charged down in here and I have it here in the blackout print. This is working as my wallet while I'm out and about. These are perfect for traveling with because they are small and compact and do not take up much space. Next to that in the other pocket over here, I have a small set piece in Black Magic. And in here I have just a med kit for the boys. So I always take a med kit, especially to theme parks because kids are very excited. They're running around, they might trip and fall and hurt themselves. So I also have some medicine in here for my husband and I, just in case we get a headache while we're out some throat lozenges, nail clippers, a little happy face stickers down in there, and gauze, band-aids, all that good stuff, just in case somebody gets hurt. In front of those two pockets, down in the empty part in the very front here, I have my small set piece in Queen's Court. In here I have things for myself, so I have a chapstick, lip gloss, mirror, folding hairbrush, and some hand cream down in there, and some hair ties and things like that. So the reason why I left this one in the very front here is because it's a lot easier to open this pocket and grab things from the actual pocket part instead of from back here. So the things that I put back here, I put in there because I don't grab for them very often. But here, I definitely need to have my chapstick readily available. Next, let's go through the side bottle pockets. Now in this side, I just have my sunglasses. I found that these bottle pockets are pretty tight if you try to put like a sippy cup or something in there. It is possible to do it, but it's a lot easier to put like skinnier baby bottles or things that are a little thinner in this pocket. So I put my sunglasses in there for easy access. A lot of times I just wear them on my head, but sometimes if you're on a ride or something, you do not want to be wearing them on your head. They would just fly off. So on this side, I have my keys which I could easily also throw into the very front pocket here, but I was out and about earlier with this bag and um, that was just an easy pocket for me to put them in. Now let's go through that top pocket real quick. So this is that top pocket I was telling you about. This is a felt lined pocket. This is a great pocket for a very small camera or for your smartphone. So I have my iPhone 8 Plus down in there. As you guys can see, this is a good size phone. So being able to just pop it down in there is a great option. So that's what I've got in there. I had a little extra room too, so if I really needed to put something else in there, I could. And that's it for the outside of the bag. Let's jump onto the inside. And I think you guys are gonna like how I have it packed up because I used the B switched in it, and it's amazing in this bag, you guys. This bag opens about oh, a little bit more than halfway down the bag. So let's go ahead and open the front up. 
You guys can already see the beast switched in there. I'm gonna flip this back so you guys can see even better. All right, so the bee switched is a removable insert that is made for the bee light, but it also works with a lot of other jujube bags. This insert allows you to utilize a lot more pockets for a bag that doesn't have very much organization. So this is how I have it packed up, and I absolutely love it. It's gonna be so easy to use this at the theme park. So I think I'm going to go ahead and pull this out of here so you guys can see it just a little bit better, but I did wanna first show you guys how well this fits in here. It's Perfect, so let's go ahead and pull this out. This is what the bee pack looks like when it's empty. As I said, there's not too much going on in there. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and bring back out the bee moved. Here we are. So this is how I have it set up in there. And I wanted to cut down on pouches, so I utilized all the pockets in here. In the very first pocket here, the very back zipper pocket, I have a throwaway change pad. I figured if I'm going to a place like a theme park, I don't wanna take my nice change pads anyways. So if I take one of these, I can just toss it when we're done for the day. So I've got my throwaway change pad. I also have one of the Jujube wet bags. They have two different kinds. This is the smaller one. I believe this one comes with the Be Equipped. So that's what I have, just in case there's a wet mess and I need to contain it somehow. In front of the zippered pocket, you have two deep mesh elastic pockets. These are perfect for diapers and wipes, so I have three size three diapers on this side. I also have my wipe pouch 30 on this side, and then I have a baggie dispenser right here, and then I have a milk right here. Down in the main compartment here, I have a GGB medium set piece. This has a change of clothes for my son. It has socks, pants, and a shirt. I'm not gonna go ahead and open it right now. I'm trying to keep this bag packed, kind of, sort of, because I don't wanna have to redo it after I'm done here, because we're leaving tomorrow. I'm excited. Also down there, I have two Z-bars. My kids absolutely love these. Do your kids love the Z-bars as much as mine do? Like, I've never had one, but they are like obsessed with those. So we have those, and then I have two go-go squeezes. These are both for my older two. I have an eight-year-old, a five-year-old, and an almost two-year-old. So these big boy snacks are for my older two, and then all the baby's things are right here in the front. So let's go ahead and flip this around. So on this side here, I have one water for my son. I found that these top pockets here are really great for water bottles and cups and things like that and snacks. So I have one water here. The other waters for my boys are going to be in the stroller caddy. So I love that I don't have to actually tote those around. <laughs> I also have a granola bar for my little guy. And then I have a fruit pouch for him too. And then I also have a oatmeal square for him as well. He's my snacker, so he always has to have something to keep him happy. Down at the bottom here, you have two more elastic mesh pockets. This thing has pockets galore, <laughs> so I love it. I love it for the bee pack, it's perfect. I have two fruit snacks down in there for my older two. So guys, that is it. There's also two more pockets, one here and then one here, but I didn't need to utilize those because literally this is all I think I'm gonna need for this trip. And I'm super excited to pack this bag up this way and try it out for the very first time. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. And if you did, please give a big thumbs up and definitely subscribe while you're here if you're new. Comment below in this video and let me know what you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching.